Hey crypto watchers and welcome back to the show. In addition to cryptocurrency news, I'm gonna start making videos that will show you how to code on blockchain. We're gonna focus in on Ethereum and smart contracts. And in this episode, we're gonna create our own token that you can give to your mom, send to your friends, sell to your friends, and even hodl. This coin will be totally useless, but you can still hodl it. Like all my videos, I hope to do this in less than five minutes because it's actually really simple. First, let's get the code. In the description down below, you should see a GitHub link. When we click on that, we get to the code repository. So here's the code repository. Next, you wanna click on simple token.soul. This will be the code that we're gonna to use to create the token. So next we go to Mist Wallet. You can use other things like My Ether Wallet or MetaMask, but I use a Mist Wallet because it's developed by the Ethereum developers. It's kind of annoying because they require you to download the whole blockchain every time you, uh, you like start it up. This should change in the future, but it does kind of suck. I'll also have a link down below where you can download the wallet. If enough people ask me, I can also make a tutorial for that as well. So first when we enter, we're gonna be at wallets. Next we go to contracts. We click on deploy new contract. Click on the correct account that you will be transferring from. So you will need to have some ether on this account, probably like $2 worth, because it does take some gas to deploy the contract. Okay, cool. So here we click on Sol Solidity Contract Source Code. You should see some example code here. We want to copy and paste the code from the GitHub into here. So on the right hand side, you can now click on a contract. You're gonna click on Simple Token. Now there's gonna be some constructor parameters you need to fill out. Uh, for this, we're gonna have 1,000 coins. Let's call it Crypto Watchers token. Uh, let's do no decimal units. And the token symbol can be CTW. Uh, for a fee, I'm going to make it less than $2. This should be approximately $1 something, $1.50. Okay, cool. It says my transaction will be likely mined in within a few minutes, so that's good enough for me. So MIST requires you to, you can always change the maximum fee in here. So I'm just gonna change it to 582 because that's the estimated fee consumption. And then here I will, you, so MIST requires you to put in a password as well. So if you click on the wallet that you used, you should be able to see the status here. A few inches later. Okay, great. So now if you go click on the account where you used to create the contract, you should be able to see your token and the amount that you created. Okay, cool. So now you can send this token to whoever you want. You just put in their address in the to field and then the amount in the amount field. Remember to hit crypto watchers token or whatever your token is called you can also change the fee you will still be paying ether fee because the miners still have to get paid so that about wraps it up i hope you learned something you can now create a coin using the code that i made in the future episodes i'll definitely dive deeper into the code we could probably create a way to freeze people's accounts have a voting system and even crowdfund and have an ico i think you're going to be pretty surprised on how easy it actually is so as always if you like the video comment like subscribe and if you have any ideas for future videos leave a comment